We've got a 16-foot Grumman canoe, and we haul it behind our tiny Geo Metro, which gets incidentally about 42 miles to the gallon. Let's take a closer look at the canoe and its feature set. First is, it's powered by the usual electric trolling motor, in this case the uh, Endura 30. It has five power levels for speed going forward and three in reverse. And with the battery that you see right here, we're good for about three hours at power level five, which dissipates 25 amps. Four and a half hours at power level four, which is about three miles an hour, for about four and a half hours. So it's meant, obviously, even with the pontoons that you see on either side, which I purchased at uh, Craigslist for $100, uh, it's still uh, a boat most preferable for sheltered water. So what do you suppose these other two items are? One is a Coleman generator. It puts out 8 amps at 12 volts or 1,000 watts at 110 volts. And here is a Black & Decker battery charger. And we're using that as actually a power converter. Because the 8.5 amps from the Coleman at 12 volts isn't enough to charge the battery and run the motor at the same time. So we'll go through the Black & Decker battery charger and then we'll be able to get some 23 amps at 12 volts which is plenty to recharge the battery when it gets low and to keep the motor running at the same time. Notice the Coleman generator has an exhaust system which if we walk around on the other side keeps a lot of nasty gases behind the operator of the boat. One thing that you can't underestimate is comfort. So the chair you see here is from REI and it cost about $39. Normally there's one back here where the operator sits and another one in the bow which can be seated with a passenger looking forward or looking back towards the stern. Okay, we're going to launch now and uh, we'll be at the north end of Lake Caganza and we're going to head up the O'Hare River about three or four miles. Lake Caganza is south of Madison, Wisconsin by about 20 minutes by car. Okay, time for a little reverse. We're going to back away from the pier. It's semi-deep. It's enough I think I can lower my motor a little more. So, you can even rent an apartment here that has a well, let's give them a call. Here's a house for sale. Do a videotape it. A modest little place, but... Has a fireplace. It's gorgeous in the fall with all the leaves, don't you think? Yeah, who's the father's? It's even semi-dredged out. Well, it's quite a big boat here. Yeah. But they all have probably inboards where they can swing up. What we'll have to do is look at their propellers to see how badly they're boogered up. Then we'll know how shallow it is here. They're 
watching us closely. Geese and ducks. Let's see.